everybody. My name is Sandhvi Risha. I am still in class 15. I am a student of lovely public senior secondary school. Today, I am here to discuss some indoor activities with you which you can do at your home only. So, I have made an installation, a rectangular light box and I have divided it into many parts. I have made this rectangular box using colorful tapes. You can make it longer and wider also according to the space you have at your home. And from this single installation, we will do many activities. So our first activity is jumping forward with move your legs. Like this. Remember that your foot does not touch any line. And second activity is jumping forward on a single leg. Like this. It's the best activity for balance, coordination and muscle strength. Our next activity is walking with wide gait. Means you have to take miscord position and then you have to walk. Our fourth activity is backward jumping. Means you have to see back and then jump like this. It's the best activity for coordination and motor planning. Our fifth activity is walking on a straight line. Like this. It needs a lot of balance and coordination. Or otherwise we can lose. Similarly we can take a round also. Our sixth activity is jumping sideways with both your legs. Like this. You can use a single leg also. Make sure that you use your both legs and a single leg also. Our next activity is number game. Means imagine that I write here 5, I write here 3, I write here 4 and I write here 2. So, you say me jump on number 5. I have to jump on number 5. You say me jump on number 3. So, I have to jump on number 3. You say me jump on number 4. So, I have to jump on number 4. Our next activity is making numbers within this activity. Means, you say me make number 3. So, I have to walk in a way that my walk is similar to number 3. Like this. Our next activity is use of a ball. Means, okay, you say me bounce the ball and then jump. Bounce the ball and then jump. Means, if I succeed to catch the ball, then I have to go forward. And if I'm not able to catch the ball, then I have to go back. Our next activity is rolling the ball on a straight line, like this. Means you have to make sure that you do not lose your ball at any point of time. So these are the activities which you can do at your home only. So at last, I would thank my principal ma'am, my in charge ma'am and all the teachers for giving me this opportunity to perform this activity in front of you. Thank you.